What's up? All right, here we are. We're checking baits. But it is time for another episode in our 10th anniversary series. And uh, I'm up to bed again. Peasley's busy on his lobster boat. Could be lost at sea for all we know. Nobody knows where he is. Uh, but anyway, so I'm up to bed again. And my second pick is actually one I'm going to uh, toot my own horn with a little bit. This is from back, I uh, came out on our season three DVD. It was a bow hunt for deer. I was about a week and a half post knee surgery. I had a torn meniscus repaired. And shouldn't have been in the woods, let alone climbing trees, but uh, I wanted to get down onto this property in one of Maine's expanded zones before firearm season opened. This is on the outskirts of one of those expanded zones, so uh, there was no firearms ordinances on this property. They could gun hunt it, and they did pretty hard every year. So I wanted to get in there and try and get a deer in the freezer before uh, the bow hunting was pretty much null and void. Uh, so that's what I did. Everything worked out perfect. Um, obviously needed help getting the deer out of the woods, so that's why uh, my recovery key, the my recovery team came in to give me a hand. Um, this property down in where I was hunting was just a nasty hellhole to begin with. It's hard enough for a guy to get a deer out of there by himself, let alone somebody who couldn't pull with his knee screwed up like that. So. My wife and three kids came down in. Um, this is way back in 2012, uh, so my kids were way younger then. So uh, that's one of the reasons why why I like this hunt to see them. They always used to, um, at that age, even ground blind sets and stuff, they'd come and, and bow hunt with Dad. And... Maniac Outdoors, 10th anniversary series, season three bow hunt for deer in Maine. Check it out. wonder why they call us maniacs. Here's a prime example. Jason Jacks just had knee surgery. A week later, he decides he's gonna get up in the tree stand and fling arrows at you. Check this out. Well, here we go. I uh, expanded zone tonight. It's my first sit since my surgery, so hoping for some goodness. Just getting a lot of pictures down in here before my surgery, so I'm hoping, and I was seeing a lot of deer too, so hoping that continues. Let's see what happens.
she just crashed. She just crashed. Firearm season is literally four days away, three days away. This place last year, these gun hunters come in here and started hammering on it. So it's pretty much over after that. Um, I wanted to get in here, but I just had knee surgery. Last two weeks ago, not even two weeks ago, week and a half ago. So I'm not supposed to be climbing trees. So. I'm pretty sure she went down. You guys fine. She's gonna taste good, isn't she? Hi, I see where you got her right there. Well, here she is. We found her. She only went 50 yards, maybe. Um, nice big doe. Big healthy girl. I imagine she's got quite a bit of fat in there. You know, they've been hammering the acorns this year. Big acorn here, but um, shot was a lot better than I thought. It was pretty much perfect. Um, you know, steep shot angle, but I mean, she was dead before she knew it. So the G5 T3 did her in good. But yeah, my recovery team come in and uh, we followed the blood trail down. She wasn't. I knew I heard her pile up. So anyway, first deer of the year. Expanded archery zone, so we can still keep going.